Hello there. Welcome to the setup tutorial for our mini Orange WordPress LDAP intranet free plugin. To download the plugin, please navigate to your WordPress dashboard and click on Plugins. Click on the Add New button to install the plugin. Search for Mini Orange LDAP. In the search results, click here to install and activate the plugin. Now, you will be able to see the plugin on the dashboard. Please proceed by clicking on it. You can take the plugin tour as well as full featured trial of our premium plugin. If you are looking for multi site solution, click here to check out our plans and pricing. Our plugin is compatible with all the different directory servers available. For the purpose of this setup video, we will be using the Microsoft Active Directory server. The plugin supports connecting to your server using either the LDAP or LDAPS protocol. Please proceed with entering the LDAP server hostname or IP address. Proceed with specifying the LDAP admin username and password. Click on the Test Connection and Save button to verify the LDAP connection. Scroll down to the LDAP User Mapping Configuration section. The search base you mention will allow the plugin to search for users under that search base. You can have a look at the different possible search bases present in your Active Directory by clicking on Possible Search Bases, Base DNs. Please select or specify the search base or organizational unit. Proceed with selecting the username attribute. You can select any of the mentioned attributes from the drop downs. The username attribute you mention will be the basis on which the user's presence will be verified from the Active Directory. Click on Save User Mapping. Scroll down to the Test Authentication section. To test the LDAP authentication, you can enter any username and password of a user present in the Active Directory. And click on the Test Authentication button. Once the test authentication is done, click on the Role Mapping tab. In the free version of our plugin, Role Mapping will assign a specific role to all the LDAP users that log in. Click on the Enable Role Mapping button to enable the role mapping. If you do not wish to override the existing roles of the users present in the WordPress website, Click on Keep Existing Roles of Users button. Select a default WordPress role for these users. Once done, click on the Save Configuration button. We provide extended functionalities within this tab. To unlock them, you can contact us. Click on the Next button to proceed to the Attribute Mapping tab. The email attribute is the default configuration present in our free plugin. Enter the email domain you would like to assign to the users whose email attribute is not already set in the Active Directory. Click on the Save Configuration button. Now, scroll down to the Test Attribute Configuration section. Enter a username of any user present in the Active Directory. Click on the Test Configuration button. A test successful pop-up will be shown. Scroll up and click on the Next button to proceed to the Sign In Settings tab. Simply click on the Enable LDAP Login button. This will enable the users who are present in the Active Directory to log in to the WordPress website using their LDAP credentials. In the free version of our plugin, you can enable admin users to log in using both their LDAP server and WordPress password. This feature allows you to automatically register users into the WordPress database when they log in. In our premium version of the plugin, you can authenticate WordPress users from both LDAP and WordPress. You have now successfully set up our WordPress LDAP plugin. Now, let's log in the user into WordPress site using the credentials stored in the Active Directory. Enter the username and password and click on Login button. You have successfully logged in to the WordPress site using the credentials stored in the Active Directory. Let's check out additional features that we provide along the plugin. There are a few more additional tabs which provide specific features. If your use case requires connecting your WordPress website to multiple LDAP servers, we provide this functionality in the premium version of our plugin. You can contact us to get more information about this. The Configuration tab will allow you to export the configuration of the plugin from one WordPress site to another. This will be useful if you do not wish to reconfigure our LDAP plugin on another WordPress website. The Authentication Report 
will inform you about the failed login attempts that have been made while users are trying to log in to your WordPress website. You can export these reports in CSV format. And you can clear the logs as well. We provide an array of add-ons that work in perfect congruence with our premium plugin. You can have a look at them in the add-ons section. To have a look at the premium plugin licensing plans we offer, make sure to click on the licensing plans button. To take the full featured free trial of our premium plugin, please check out the description. Thanks for watching. For more information you can reach us at www.miniorange.com and you can also contact us at ldapsupport at securify.com.